What up guys, Kuda from Team XX here doing a mini review, first look, whatever you want to call it, of the Dead Mouse levels featured on Sound Shapes, game just released on the PlayStation Network. As I said before, this game is going to be one of my uh, staples for a while just because it's so fucking awesome. But uh, yeah, I noticed Dead Mouse. he contributed to a whole series of levels, four levels to be exact, uh, levels 4, 1, 2, 3, and 4 that are in the later half of the game and you can start playing the first one right from the start uh, I think because it lets you pick from all the different albums or whatever and the first thing I noticed is holy shit Dead Mouse levels have a lot of 8-bit themes which for me oh my god you put pixel art 8-bit themes into a level and you have my fucking heart one so if you listen real closely and if you're familiar with Dead Mouse, you'll instantly recognize just, you know, the electronic -y feel of it. Stuff that he's pretty well known for. He's always been, you know, an electronic artist, innovating, doing stuff like that. And the music in his levels is like a perfect fit for the art style that they chose. It's just like 8-bit-ish, uh, chip tune-ish, and it's just it's pretty fucking amazing. Like, I don't know. I had a hard time like keeping my happy levels down after watching this just because it was so fucking awesome. You know, he's got this whole Space Invaders theme going on, uh, kind of compiled with a, like an Asteroids theme, and it's just, it's kind of blowing my mind at this point. I just love things that remind me of my childhood, the dawn of gaming. I'm a big uh, history of gaming buff, so this is kind of just like, it's a real, like, it's an awesome homage to, you know, what gaming has been to me. And, has always been in my opinion is just you know so anyway you're seeing level 4-2 right now and things are getting pretty pretty complicated and you get to 4-3 he just he keeps ramping it up like a few notches the music keeps evolving it's always going to have this like electronic -y house type feel to it which i also love i'm a i'm not a huge uh, techno lover but i do love electronic music occasionally from here and there and this is definitely it gave me my fix for the day put it that way and it kind of harks back to just in general in this game, you know, just like the classics of gaming, you know, it's simple jumping, rolling, collecting of coins, and the music in it, when they mix it and match it, especially when you collect the coins, as you can see, it keeps adding music to it. It just brings that whole classic concept for me to a whole new level. As you can see here, you're going to be jumping across, matching exactly with the timing, and it's creating this like whole... It's like this awesome feel of like interacting with the music. Uh, this level is particularly interesting because it has a lot to do with like enemy engagement. The, the enemies in the level and the other objects have a lot more to do with the soundtrack than just the actual like collecting of coins. And Dead Mouse did a really awesome like thing by combining you know both the enemies in the levels perfectly with the actual music, which is something that I think only a Somebody who's mastered the whole concept of sound shapes would actually be able to pull off, and he's done it pretty damn well. As you progress further through his levels, they become more like, they pay homage to more classic games. Like, this is like more like a Brick Breaker type level, and that just like kind of threw me for a loop. I'm like, well, I didn't realize you could do that with this game. Dead Mouse always throwing his face up. Uh, he did a real awesome job. If there's like any one set of levels I think you should play in this game, Sound Shapes, it should definitely be the Dead Mouse levels, like, or anything else inspired by like Dead Mouse or whatever, because it's got everything that I like just have known and loved pretty much forever. You know, 8-bit theme, classic games, what have you, and you just did a fucking bang up job. I got like literally nothing bad to say about the Dead Mouse levels. It's just. Everything's a perfect homage to what I love. Anyway, guys, this is Kuda from Team X Eggs. Time to wrap things up. Like I said, more sound shapes. You got it. Got some more on the way. We're going to see what else I can pull out of this game before you know, it gets stale and stagnant, which I don't see happening anytime soon. But anyway, peace out.